friends. How many of us have them? Friends. Ones we can depend on. Let's be friends. Hmm. <laughs> Friends, let's be friends. 15 good minutes coming right back at you, YouTube. Here with you, Kirk, the love Dr. Robinson, along with... Shy Glizzy. How y'all doing? I don't know about that Shy Glizzy thing. <laughs> we want to fix that. We, we didn't talk about that before. That Shy Glizzy thing. It just comes out like so <laughs> hey, fluid. Don't, wow. It just comes out fluid. Wowzers. All right. So, coming <laughs> at you guys this uh, week. Um, friends, like... How many of us really have them? Is that your friend? Can I Are date? They... Can your friend date your ex? Can you date the ex, the friend of an ex? Can I holler at your girl? No. Why? No. I mean, you can holler at her. Is she going to accept the holler? No. Okay, so me and you don't work out, right? But I got a chance to get along or get it on with somebody else and it may be your friend. Like, you can't hate on that, bro. Like, it's get not out the hating. Way. Get out of the way. It's not <laughs> You blocking my blessing. Get it's out of the way. It's not hating. It wasn't for you. It's not hating. She might be for me. I can't get with her. No, I uh, uh, uh. So you won't date none of my friends. No. 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 So if he shoot his shot, what you doing? I'm a sh. Uh, no, matumbo. no, no, yeah, no, 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 no. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I mean that's happened before where I was dating somebody and we didn't work out, and the friend tried to talk to me. Ooh. Mm. I said, oh, no, brother, that's not how we roll. I don't love the crew. So he tried to get you the homie hop. I never heard that. Mm. Yeah, I don't love the crew. Oh, man. So crew love is not your way to go. Okay. The we we that's weekend's job, not right. me. Well, okay, so speaking personally, you know what I'm saying, from experience, um, it depends. You love the crew, I know. It, no, no. Honestly, I'd rather you not. Yeah, because it's just a little touchy. I don't want to see him again. The ex. Yeah. But yeah. like when I think about it though, bringing it to you the way that I just brought it to you, like I don't want to <laughs> block nobody blessing them. You find happiness there, you know what I'm saying? And you know, you like kissing on things that I didn't touch before, then that's on you. <laughs> <laughs> I think hey. I I've never been in a situation where one of my girlfriends were interested in somebody I talked to. So I mean, you could think like middle school, elementary school, you know, that kind of thing. Well, y'all passed around, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Passed around, yeah. But as a grown woman, I've never been in this situation. So I can't truly, honestly say how I would react. I mean, I think the principle would be, especially if we're like sisters, you know, kind of certain things, there's a boundary, I think. Mm. Um, but I, I guess until that day happens, and it won't, mm. <laughs> it won't. So Kayla, <laughs> Nikki. Danielle, y'all know what it is. Mm. Um, we would, I mean, from 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 my perspective now, I don't think I would go go with it. But I mean, to each their own. I've heard great stories mm. of. This thing worked out for some. Yeah. For others, not so much. I mean, much. in my family, people have dated siblings, and they're married. Wowzers. So Down, you know, so. Mm. Yeah, and that's real close to home, right? You gotta you talk about not wanting to see. Like, hold on, now, like step brother <laughs> or no, like, like brother brother. Full blown blood or sister. Brother. Whoa, like grew up together. Like yeah, same brother. mama, same daddy, same house. Yeah. So everybody at the table at Thanksgiving. Everybody and their mom. Sheesh. Mm -hmm. I don't want to be in that room. So, yeah, I guess Maybe I do. Fly on the wall. See how it go. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. T stay on. I don't, I don't know though. Like, man, I, under the lights right now, I kind of feel mixed about it. Under the lights. Cause like, if I if me and that individual had bad blood, then I don't. You don't want to be I around don't. them. True. So if you were friends with the person, if that person and I were friends, like you know what, it's all about how you do it. You know what I mean? Okay. Like you handle things basically how it's pre like presented to you. Mm -hmm. You know, like I may come to you with the the worst job ever, but the way I present it to you, you may take the it. appealing. Right. So like, if you want to date an ex. Be man enough, woman enough to come to me. Well, that's the thing. Come have that conversation. Don't be sneaky about don't it. Don't be sneaky. Don't do it and then come really tell put me. I'm going to down and be like, you must have felt some type of way if you couldn't come to me, right? You knew you was doing wrong and then therefore you right. want to come and talk to me after the fact. Right. And that's not cool. So, like, the best thing, in my opinion, the best thing to do is. But see, then that's also can be tough too. So, like, what's her name? Who? Nikki. Nikki, Danielle, All right. so Nikki, right? All right, so me, me and Nikki meet, and I'm like, oh, you're 
you're Shy's friend. Mm. Hmm. But then me and Nikki start talking. Yeah, not. Nah. Yeah. Ah! So like, but hold on now, you got to hit. No, because so like, I nope. wasn't involved before to start Liz, talking. Listen, Linda, listen. That's the second time somebody <laughs> said it to me this week. So, so, um, me and Nikki are talking and I'm like, you know, I like you, you cool. What are we going to do with this? If Nikki and I are just cool and okay with just being friends, then that's, there's nothing to tell you. But. If Nikki and I are starting to feel each other and it's no longer a platonic thing, <clears throat> then we should, one of us should come to you and be like, hey, um, before we go any further, before we go any further, let's talk about this. I think. Because there's no need to blow up anything to, you know what I'm saying, to cause a rift. Because like within my, I'm sorry, within my friends, right? Right? Homeboy, right? This is my man, my Hey, man, we all boys, right? I ain't gonna put his name out there. That's her. I ain't gonna do that to y'all. But, you know what I'm saying? He was dating a woman in college, right? Yeah. Like, that's bookie love. You know how that college love mm -hmm. thing go, right? You thought, mm -hmm. oh, yeah. Together. I'm never gonna be with anyone else. I love him. <laughs> right? So, he was with this woman. They broke up. One of the fellas in the crew ended up getting with the girl. How and tight were they, though? Who? How tight The dude in the crew and with, the, with your friend. The dude... The two dudes, mm. like, the, the guy who did it was the younger brother of the guy who had the girl first. So they grew up. Mm. Like, he grew up around. You know what I'm mm. saying? So, like, that's not really, like, we don't even call each other friends. We call each other brothers. Brothers. So if you're my brother, how do you even do this? Sure. One. And then two, so then, like, you, you cause this rift. You go chase behind something I dealt with and then y'all don't work out. So now there's forever this awkward mood and setting anytime we run. Like, hey, what's up? You know what I'm saying? Now they're like, oh, I'm to, oh, like okay. we used to okay. dap like, you know what I'm saying? And Hug and embrace. It's like now it's like, yeah. what's up? Yeah, you know what I mean? Like, I mean, why even put yourselves in that situation? I think in that situation as well, I think it depends on why you and that person broke up. So, prime example, mm. if you are my best friend, and I'm dogging the dog mess out of my girlfriend. And you're witnessing just this unruly just dogness. Mm. And a girl is a, just a fine, wholesome girl that just truly loves she this man. She said fine, wholesome. Mm. Okay. <laughs> and you're witnessing this, knowing that she doesn't deserve it. And that maybe, you know, tenders up your heart, right? <laughs> and then you kind of come in and, you know, they break up. She vents to you and y'all start talking. I think now that is a different Unacceptable. scenario. Unacceptable. Wait, why not? <sighs> How long? After? I don't know. It could be it could be a while after. It mm. could be like six months. <laughs> six months. <laughs> a year. My typical rule, I don't always follow it though, but like however long the relationship was, you need a half the time to get over. That's it. the love doctor talking right you know there. That was Let's he just, just pulled that out of his book. Now have I always abide by that? No. Yeah. <laughs> but those most of those relationships after I did not abide by that didn't, didn't work. work. <clears throat> yeah. I think it's it's the situation, I think. Um I don't know. But I mean my three sisters know. Nikki, Danielle, Kayla, they know. You what, slew down. Kayla might not be as close as you might. No, they Kayla, all they're all equally we're all equally sisters. But I mean I would it, it, with that friendship I wouldn't even I don't even have that concern. You know what okay, I mean? Okay, so <clears throat> friend from work. But you've introduced your friend from work. Because we all got friends at work, right? I don't got. Yep. Okay, well she don't fool with y'all at her job. I work with y'all. <laughs> but to be really I'm really strategic on who I call my friends. So I don't mm. have too many friends. Like I do have friends at work, and they know who they are, and we stick together. But they're married. <laughs> um. <laughs> so okay. So then that friend at work <laughs> divorced her husband. You get with her husband? No. Did you cover no. your ears? No, I, I meant to do this. Not even want to think about it. <laughs> She's all disturbed. No. <laughs> no. Mm -mm. I wouldn't. No. Mm -mm. Okay. Because like that's truly my friend. That's like. That. All right, real quick. Jay Z, my friend. Him and B go in separate ways. Oh, you gonna try to B. talk to B? <laughs> Shout out to B. I'm coming, baby. I'm coming. Sorry. You gonna be dead. That's fine. I live with it. <laughs> you live with it. I live with it. It's worth it. No. Some things worth dying over. Uh uh. 
Yeah. yeah. Mm -mm. I, mm. That's a touchy thing. It is a touch. It's a very touchy. touchy thing, but it happens all the time. But not, and well, what I, which I don't understand how. In our area, in the DMV, <laughs> right? I think the number's like 12 to 1, maybe. Mm. Right? So, like, there's 12 That's, women. Yeah. It could be, and that could be an, like, over It's a man desert. It's a man desert in D.C. Yeah, I'm sorry. And then the men, most of the men that are there, I mean, they're not there for you, you know? What I'm getting, get what I'm saying? Don't understand, don't want to know. You don't know? Nope. But you just don't want to understand. I don't know. But, yeah, so, I mean, I understand. <laughs> you got to do this. <laughs> I'm not here for this. Yeah, it is touchy. But then I think from a man's standpoint, it's a different kind of viewpoint than from a woman's. What you mean? So, like, I've been in a situation where one of my ex's friends, I've been in a couple situations where one of my ex's, fr ex's friends tried to talk to me. Mm. Or saying, you know, started off by saying, you know, you were such a good woman, blah, blah, blah. You didn't deserve that. Or, you know, Dog. I admire, blah, blah, blah. Ain't good. And it's up to I'm the woman joking. to decide if she wants to bite that bait. Mm. But I think more men do it than women. I feel. I think the thirst is equal. You think? But yeah, I think women just thir equally as if not thirstier than men are. Thirstier? Yes. You think? So you first off, first off, my my rule of thumb and my like my way of thinking, I think women are more competitive than anyone. Well, women are, are way more competitive than men. We are very like y'all. Guys dress up for women. Women dress up for women. <laughs> they do hair, makeup, everything. I'm going to get this to come out your nose before the year's over, I promise. Like, they do hair, makeup, everything for women. Which probably makes sense a lot. Like women. Bruh. I, love, I love a beat for myself. Bruh. So when I look in the mirror, I can be like, you, you did you that go, beat you, today. You go beat down in front of the mirror to be like, I'm about this, ladies. I really, I mean, personally, I don't really think about other women. Unless I know, like, it just depends on the situation. Let me just say that. If I know I'm going to be in a situation where I got to be my best, just to be the best, then I'm going to be the best. If you but know you're going to run I'm, into one of his exes. Or if I'm, you know, I just want to be like, Dang, Shy, you did that today. Go to work. Go to work, Shy. You better do that. That's different. Most of the times it's more to go to work. You do that. But there's other times like, oh, I'm about to shut everything down because I know you're there. For those of us that follow <laughs> you on Instagram, we know you do it to show up and show out. No. Shy show. Y'all tell me. Y'all go on my Instagram page and... Tell me what, what you what you feel, what you think I do mm. it, how I do it. And stay out the DMs for them yeah, dudes. Yeah, don't go to the DMs. I don't want Bay is bro. I don't want none of them problems. Bay is Brody and we'll jump you. <laughs> Period. And you don't even need to jump because it won't be nothing inter to be entertained. Just shoot me a shot. Don't even shoot. <laughs> we shoot. Matumbo. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so I think I think it's 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 uh, my personal opinion is more men do it. So we I, mean, I don't think so. But I wouldn't know because I'm not. Because women. So a, women don't come to me. Women scorn. A woman will do whatever she can to hurt him to back. To get even, you think? You don't think so? I'm never. You, you, you light skin. You, you petty. You might have a moment. Oh, you've Is had a moment. Colorism? <laughs> that, that just struck. That was colorism. I think we need to edit this out. Mm -hmm. mm, my bad. Sorry. Mm, 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 mm. Anyway, mm, mm, leave that in there. I'm Dolce de Leche. <laughs> For your information. You don't pass the brown paper back test. Lies. <laughs> anyway, but like I was saying, like, women will do that. They'll, I'll get with his friend. Like, oh, he gonna leave me. Yeah, I'll I've shoot my shot. Woman. You might not have been, but let's yeah. be real here. You know, so that, you may not know, you may not be friends with her, but you known of someone okay, that's so that. Okay, so that brings me to another point. Mm. It's in turn, that's internal. You dealing with something within yourself. You have a sickness within yourself where you have to go and do that. I agree, but so <laughs> but guys, guys, I will say this. I'm sorry, brothers. You know what I'm saying? We do get weak. And you when, fall when for the certain beat. things happen, you lose but blood in your brain and your feet, so well. you can't think, you can't run, and you did something stupid. Mm -mm -mm. It happens. But I think that's within them, themselves as well. With the guy too? Yeah. yeah. Mm. I think so. I think mm. both can be equally sick. Mm. So now she the doctor. <laughs> It's a beat. Yeah, she got to slide the prescription pad to the right. Go ahead. Yeah, Go ahead, I think doc. I think it's a sickness. I mean, I really do. And just thinking of the dudes of my exes that have tried to talk to me, they were in a place where they weren't happy with themselves, and they mm. were sick. And you mm. know they were sick, 
So my job being being whole, because I wasn't broken from it. Because that's a good wholesome woman right there. Fine wholesome woman, get it right. Oh, it's fine, fine wholesome woman. Yes. Look at that. You you I peeped it, and you don't you don't entertain that. See right through you, Judas. <laughs> that was good too. Oh, you've been on it. <laughs> that's my man. Come on, man. But yeah, so I, I believe it's a sickness. So when people are not fully whole, we're not where they're not whole because you have to be fully whole to be whole, right? You do dumb stuff like I mean, that. Three fourths of a full pack. Yeah. <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> so yeah. Three sixty. But I, I don't know. Yeah, I would mm. love to hear you guys. I don't want to hear about it. I want to hear. <laughs> I don't hear about it. And I want to hear your takes on what you, how you view my Instagram because this one obviously, <laughs> I do not do it for the people. Bruh. <laughs> Period. The only thing I do for the people on there is what I do for the community. That's what I do for the people. But that's another topic. Anyways, for uh, okay. the people. Yes, for the people. We gotta continue this offline, cause I yeah. That's fine. It's still March. It is still March. And it's National Women's Month. And you gonna run all month with it? Running. I'm sure. I'm running. See, feminism. Mm. See. Spell it backwards. M S I N I M E F. <laughs> so who you got for us? Ava DuVernay. You know her? Spell it. A V A DuVernay. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> so she's amazing. I mean, do you watch any of her like shows on OWN? OWN? Mm -hmm. Oprah's show, Oprah's network. You will not have me confess to watching OWN on yeah, air. Yeah, there's some good shows on there. What? Queen Sugar. What? That's not a woman show. Oh. Uh, Green Leaf. That got a little too crazy for me, though. Don't watch Green Leaf, but really I have watched up. Queen Sugar. Okay. I didn't know that was on OWN. I never paid attention to it. Uh -huh. Always watch it on demand. Never oh. watched it like live, I don't think. Oh, yeah, it's on OWN. But Ava DuVernay directed it. <coughs> so she actually has a movie coming out. She actually directed uh, Family Talks. Family F Sorry. Sorry, Jay-Z. The Family Feud video. She directed it. Oh, that. okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. But she's coming out with um, the movie Wrinkle in Time, March 9th, which is, like, super huge because Oprah's in it. And it's based off the book Wrinkle in Time um, that was, like, made in, like, the 60s or so. Mm. It's going to be a really, really epic film. And she's, she's really making big moves out here. So I... She's my salute woman of this week. If the movie's anything like this, Queen Sugar, I'm sure. I think everything Ava does is like with excellence and purpose and intent. Mm. So I'm, I'm excited we to need see that. that. We need intent. Yeah. And the main yeah. character is a little biracial girl, which is like, oh, that's me. Mm. I can relate. You can, okay. yeah. yeah, so salute, Ava. <laughs> salute. Salute. <laughs> I can't thank you. So, <laughs> if y'all, again, like, like, uh, not shy glizzy, shy. I'll take set. the glizzy off. But Please I'm, do. Y'all vote better. on that. Y'all let I'm us know if you cool with glizzy. that shy. I'm better than him. First off, anything with glizzy attached to it isn't appropriate. Not for what? an adult. A, isn't a glizzy a hot dog? A hot <laughs> dog? <laughs> a real country. A hot dog? <laughs> Don't they call them glizzy? I'm out of here. <laughs> See y'all next week. <laughs> Wait, because I just learned that from a kid. Isn't the glizzy a hot dog in DC? Yeah. We'll talk but I'm offline. Not we'll talk off here. Oh. Okay. So oh, thank you. Oh no, I don't want it. No. <laughs> so please, can you take us out, please? I can't. <laughs> so please, at the bottom, type in your comments, questions, concerns, any stories, any situations that you would like to share with us. Follow us on social media. I am Kirk underscore in underscore out. Um, and this is Shy Show Bob underscore. All on Instagram. Follow us at 15 Good Minutes. Um, subscribe on YouTube. Make sure you do that. Yeah, subscribe. Tell a friend, tell a friend. <laughs> you can tell an ex. <laughs> okay. Yeah, do let's, that. Let's all be friends. <laughs> friends. How, How many, many of us have them? Friends. Bye, y'all. Peace. <laughs>